Chilly, ice in your veins. You're practicing that kick in the warm up. <laughs> yeah, I'd have missed it. <laughs> Yeah, well, I was, oh, it was just panic set in and then it was all just relief. Um, yeah, it was nice. Like, I missed a couple of those this in the past 18 months. Um, those match winners that make you get the fly half stock up and, and down, and I've missed a few, so it was nice to actually finally get one. And, and it was probably the best kick of the day as well. Like, it was the best strike I've hit, so it was lovely. So talk us through it. In that moment, it's a game that's been based on very small margins. There was one point pretty much in all the game. And then you find yourself there winning the penalty in extra time, pretty much. Um, what's going through your head? Uh, uh, pretty much every single forward was like, you could do it, you could do it. So I was like, all right, just leave me alone a little bit, lads. Um, and then it was just kind of like trying to go back to a bit of process, um, just trying to get the shape and, and get the kick right. And like I said, it was probably the best strike I hit all day in terms of the quality of it. So it was nice to actually get, get a decent shot and, and finish it like that. So. You also may not be aware, but you've um, over, uh, you've gone over 50 points for Leicester Tigers. So that's a nice little achievement as well to be celebrating in uh, uh, with a win today. Oh yeah, uh, I don't matter if I got a thousand points. Like a win's a win, isn't it? Like that's all I really worry about. Um, just because I, I couldn't care if I hit nine from nine from 19 and then hit the last one to win it. As long as we win it at the end, like it doesn't matter. So yeah, it's a nice little milestone personally, but uh, just hopefully many more to come. Getting into the game, obviously it was a, a gritty game, uh, very tough at times, um, but you've been talking about staying in the game and making memories, and I think you achieved that tonight. Oh yeah, absolutely. Like I said, we wanted that 80 minute performance, uh, which we, we, we've struggled with the past couple of weeks. Um, so to get that and to dig in right to the death, I mean, it was a whole squad squad effort with guys coming off the bench that won that scrum penalty and then, um, yeah, like I said, that kick at the end. But uh, yeah, it's been nice. Like I said, Dan touched on memories uh, pre-game and at half time he said, look, if we can come in here in 40 minutes time and an hour's time and make those memories, that's all. That's what it's all about. So uh, I think we did that today. In case anyone else can't hear it, there's tigers being <laughs> shouted in the background. How, how good is the travelling support? They absolutely soaked a lot of them, but yeah, fair play to them. They stuck it out and uh, even with a bit of added time on the end and the, the long game, like oh, fair play to them, it's been, been brilliant. Like I can hear them even, even with a few murmurs from Bath fans, I could hear the shushes and stuff from Tigers fans towards the end. So it was lovely, that, that little bit of support and that little bit of added, added uh, help got us over the line.